Hare Krishna viewers, I am Acharya Pooja. Welcome to Vedic Astro Kendra. In a series of a monthly horoscope prediction, we have given a complete analysis of two signs in our previous video. In this video, we will talk about Gemini sign. We will give you a complete picture of analysis of your chart based on your moon sign or your ascendant sign. Like if you have a Gemini sign by birth sign or by ascendant sign, you can check either of side. And also, you must go through the complete video because in the end, we will tell you about the remedy. So let's talk about the transit because without transit, we cannot analyze your horoscope. So the transit, if we see the placement of the planets as per your chart or the movement of the planet throughout the month of February. So let's talk about your Lagnesh, Mercury. Presently, it is transiting in your 7th house, but on 7th of Feb, it will join the 8th house, which is not a good house, a trick house, or you can see a Dushtana house. And, and from here, Sun will go to the uh, 9th house on 13th of Feb and join or conjunct with Saturn. So it's a good house, but uh, the Saturn is, is a very enemy. Uh, for uh, uh, Sun and from here Venus will join uh, Jupiter in the 10th house in a Pisces sign and become exalted on 15th of Feb. Rao Ketu is transiting in your 11th and your 5th house respectively and Mars is transiting in your 12th house. So this is a picture of uh, transit of the planet as per your chart. Based on this we will analyze your complete concern related to your personal life and professional life. First we will talk about your health. Let's begin with your health how this month will bring uh, bring uh, on your health uh, health issues and also you will see some health related issues in the month of february because lagnesh is transiting from your seventh house to the eighth house so you will see some um, issues relating to your health all of a sudden you will see a decline in your health especially if you are a diabetic patient you need to be very careful about it moreover you may have some uh, like blood related uh, problem like blood infections or blood pressure so you need to be very careful about it abstain from taking pressures anxiety or worries it's better to opt for uh, meditations yoga you will see a good uh, changes in your health and also a good lifestyle with a good homemade food but still you need to be very careful about it because lagnesh is joining your eighth house may get uh, may give you some temporary health issues but on 20th uh, 7th of feb when uh, mercury will join in your ninth house and you will see a good uh, improvement in your health. But for a short period of time, you need to be very careful about your health. Let's talk about your education and career. Students may feel are under pressure or low confidence regarding to their study. They must be very speculative about their planning and hard work. They might be have fear in their mind about getting a lower marks or fail in the exams. You should come out of it through meditation. Every time I say about or talk about meditation, do meditation on OM. Meditation is a very miraculous remedy for it's a very miraculous remedy regarding your, all your problems, your personal problem, your professional problem. You may come out of it that through meditation don't take it so lightly because meditation is a very very antidote remedy for all your problems it may increase your uh, concentration power your focus power and also your confidence level so you must opt meditation and also because of rahu ketu you will be in a state of delusion about your study you must be feeling very overconfident or uh, lower confidence but you have to come out of it because these things can hamper you to get a good mark in your examination and also you might get uh, like a not a good uh, success in your career as well and if you're trying for the campus placement this month can be a good fruitful for you you will also get not only a good offer but a good package as well and also if you're trying to appear in the competition you may see initial struggle but later in the part of the month like in the mid of uh, fab you will see a good success and uh, and your hard work will pay you back in the same way but Saturn as usual always give you result only after when you do the hard work and good struggle so make sure that you do good work and hard work and make a planning in your study and go accordingly so that Saturn will pay you in the same manner and as per your desired result so don't forget to do meditation it's very very necessary for you if you really want to get success in your life 
let's talk about your workplace and business first your workplace you will join some skill development program so that it may add extra edge in your resume and also your performance in your workplace would be a very satisfactory and very good and also you not only get a good appreciation but there's a good chances of uh, promotions and increment for the transferable job you may get a uh, some uh, good transfer as per your desired and also you might get some uh, opportunity to travel later to your work on the foreign land so don't miss this opportunity uh, later you will get repented only you will also notice some uh, changes or sudden obstacle or hurdle in your career you might think to get change uh, to get change to uh, your workplace to the other place or maybe switch to the other job because of this uh, uh, Saturn and because of the Sun conjunction in your ninth house so this may cause this kind of problem and also you will see that uh, your uh, subordinate or your boss is not cooperating with you so you need to be very cautious about it and try to avoid any conflict and argument with your boss because this may cause a really uh, serious problem to your career and also you will see a fabulous growth in your career especially if you are in into the consultation field or in a communication field you will see a good growth in your career now let's talk about your business if you're in a business you will see this February month gonna be a very good fortune for you not only a good context you will get but also you will get a good opportunity for a new investment also you will also see a good creativity in your business especially after mid of fab when venus will join your jupiter you will see a continuous prosperity in your business if you've been facing the problems or hurdles in your business this february month will er eradicate all your problems and worries in your business also if you're in industries of clothes or medicines or a fashion industry you will see a good growth in this industries also so in a share market if you like to invest then you have to be very cautious about it this is not a good time to investment in a share market and also you should need to curtail your expenses over expenses can disbalance your budget a budget so overall if I see for the business this February month is gonna be a great a great super fortune for you and you will see a real prosperity in your business so let's talk about your love relationship and your marriage relationship so first let's glance at love relationship for love relationship i must say that ketu can be your spoiled spot it can cause a serious damage to your relationship and you might be feeling some kind of delusion or det detachment in your relationship so ketu, ketu because of this he's getting all these trauma if you are already in a relationship the trust issue is a major issue in between you people and also because of rahu you um, must be thinking that the person is something else in front of you and something else on your back so this is kind of thing you must be facing in your relationships you need to have a great faith in your gut listen to your inner voice before taking decision in a hurry so you need to be a very cautious very matured about it and take decision accordingly and also if you're looking for uh, to uh, getting a married to your desired partner you will get success in especially after mid of feb so initial struggles you might might some no, might have noticed about it or some kind of uh, like a reject uh, rejection from your families but later part of the month you will be successful in convincing them not only convincing them but also they will also uh, happily participate in your marriage function but for the love relationship you must be very careful about it and also need to be control on your anger or your agitations and also on your hurriness in taking decision if i talk about a married couple or a marriage relationship you will see a continuous a gradual improvement in your marriage relationship also when venus will join uh, the jupiter your seventh lord you will see an extra charm or sweetness in your relationship and you will develop a good bonding between your life partner and also if you're trying for budgeting a child you will see some initial struggle in that but need to be a very uh, need to be very constant in your effort and also you will uh, see some a good success of your life partner in your, your new workplace you uh, might you people might get a uh, might make a plan to go on a long term journey also so for overall if i see for the married couple for the marriage relationship this february could be a very good a very fruitful month for you guys now let's talk about some remedy this remedy you should follow and you can get a good benefit out of it first of all i must uh, suggest you to opt for a good lifestyle and good food eating habit so it will be good for your health as well and what you can do you can also donate jupiter related things on every thursday in a temple like yellow sweets or banana and also you should uh, feed uh, birds with grains this could be a great uh, best remedy for the rahu uh, like a malefic effect uh, to get abstained from the malefic effects of the rahu viewers if you have any questions queries or suggestion kindly do comment in our comment box and also we request you to please like share and subscribe our channel and 
and also if you like to get consultation of your horoscope with us you can contact us in this uh, in this given whatsapp number Hare Krishna.